Hello and welcome to a new KiCad tutorial. Today we're going to talk about how to import external 3D component models, in this case an inductor, into KiCad. This is KiCad tutorial 1.17. This video is based on this blog. I leave a link in the description to this blog below. Now you may ask, why do we want to import external 3D component models into KiCad? Well, we would like to see how our printed circuit board or PCB looks when we have all the components mounted on the printed circuit board. This is not necessary to have the printed circuit board made. It is not part of the PCB manufacturing process. It however does give us an idea of the dimensions once all the components are mounted. It is also helpful if we want to import the 3D model of the PCB into other CAD software. The 3D model of a component is represented by a step file. It has a .step or .stp file extension. If our component does not have a 3D model, we can import the step file representing the 3D model from the internet. Okay, so we're now in PCB new. Let's take a look in the 3D viewer. Click on view and then 3D viewer. But as you can see, we have a couple of capacitors. We have a IC here, we have a capacitor here, we have a resistor here, we have a resistor here. And this is actually quite nice. You can actually pan it a bit. But okay, we don't have an inductor L1. So let's see if we can get a 3D component for move this around a bit. You can get a nice 3D view of the whole thing. Perspective view and you can see the dimensions of of everything. Which is quite nice. Now let's just go back. I just want to show you something. When we create, we, we chose this DigiKey uh, inductor from Worth Electronic. I just want to show you, we did it in tutorial 1.8. It was applied by uh, DigiKey and they had that part number. And let's go to the DigiKey website. And there it is. This is, this is the uh, DigiKey part number 744 now we're interested in a 3D model file and we scroll down and remember the model file is a step file. So we scroll down and we see over here manufactured CAD models and we see ah here's a step file and we click on that and we download the file. Now I've already done that and I've stored mine. Uh, let me, let me just show you. I stored mine. I've got a little file here, KiCad 3D symbols, and I stored mine just as a test over here. And I've renamed it with the part number and I added a, a 6A. Now, what we do next is we go back to PCB New, we select the footprint like so we right click on it we go to properties and we click on the 3d settings tab now we see it doesn't have a 3d model so we click on this folder icon and we navigate to where we stored our 3d model remember i stored mine in KiCad 3D symbol, so let's go here, store it in this little test file, let's click on it like that, and select OK, and there we, there we see it's, it's on the footprint, and we can take a look if it's well located, and we can pan and get a bit around and see, yeah, yeah, it looks fine, and we click OK, and now we view, see how it 
we select view, we click on 3D viewer, and there we are, there it is. There's our um, inductor. And let's just to take a, a nice look at it, and then we can see the inductor fits perfectly on the footprint. And we, it gives us an idea of the dimensions of the inductor and how the PCB is going to look once all the components have been mounted. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Give this video a like. Please subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.